Hey, what's up guys? Travis here with Every Single Sunday. Uh, today we're in the garage and we're talking about suspension. Uh, next to me is my 2021 Gas Gas EC300. And while these bikes are pretty damn good out of the factory, uh, they don't do that well at high speed stuff. Um, so the Gas Gas EC, the KTM XCW, and the Husqvarna TE300, along with the FEs, which is the street legal Husky, and the EXC KTMs. They come with what's called the Explorer fork. Um, it's a spring fork. It works very good at low speed riding. It's smooth over the rocks, roots, stuff like that. But when you get out of second gear, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth gear, all that fun stuff where you're going really fast, the fork doesn't really hold up to multiple impacts or big impacts. Um, so there's a lot of different stuff on the market that you can do to make your bike work better. Um, today specifically, we're going to be talking about this box right here from WP Suspension. This is the Explorer Pro 6500 cartridge kit. So from the factory, the Explorer fork has an open cartridge system. Uh, basically, that means the oil is kind of floating around in there. It's not under pressure. And multiple impacts that keep hitting it can cause oil to mix in with air, which thins it out and it doesn't work as well as... Uh, you take multiple, multiple hits. Um, on top of that, this fork is set up with compression in one leg and rebound in the other, so there's not a whole lot of control. Like I said, it's great for the low speed stuff, for the rocks, the slows, uh, single track slow speed riding. Um, and the 21 fork's much better than it's been since uh, 2017 or whenever it came out. Um, so there's been companies out there that keep doing work on this thing, making it better and better. Um, I've been working with Schmidt Performance out of Paris, California for quite some time. And my 2020 KTM, we rigged up a system, or sorry, not we, they rigged up a system that was similar to like the 12 to 15 bikes where it had compression rebound in both fork legs. And it's been very, very good. I'm very happy with it. But, well, for the price, it's amazing. And uh, I want to try something different. So one of the things that everyone keeps talking about is doing a KYB conversion. So there's a company called Technical Touch. Uh, I believe they're in Corona or Ontario, California. And basically they put KYB internals into the Explorer forks. Works great, a little pricey, but pretty good. I think it's around 1800 or so. Um, there's also a few other companies like uh, Lucky MX Tech and uh, drawing a blank on the others at the moment. But WP wanted to jump onto that market and basically build their own setup that you can drop right into here, similar to the KYB conversion that everyone's doing. So the first thing I wanna address here is uh, something I was guilty of and something I keep seeing online and talking to people. Everybody sees this right here and they go, ooh, WP suspension, uh, 6500 Pro cartridge upgrade kit, cone valves. And they think they can get cone valves for $1,300 to drop into their stock forks. I was super excited when I saw that. But talked to my suspension guys, talked to Jeremy at AEO Power Sports as well, and they both said, no, this is not a cone valve setup. Um, so basically what you're getting here is WP's version of a KYB conversion. So it's a cartridge kit uh, that's gonna replace all the internals on here. You're gonna have compression on both legs. You're gonna have rebound on both legs. You're gonna have a closed cartridge setup so it's not gonna fill up with air and get all weird on you. And uh, you're gonna have preload adjustment as well. So there's all sorts of cool stuff in this box. Let's go ahead, open it up and see exactly what's in here before I take it over to my suspension guys, uh, Schmidt Performance in Paris, California for them to work their magic. Hey, feel I'm in the mood for a switcher. I hit the function, hit the rose right till I hiccup. I hit the stage and leave with money that say stick up. She picks your perfect, so I told him I'm a flicker. Bill, I'm in them. All right, so I unpacked some of the components here, not everything that was in the box, and just wanted to give you guys a quick look at what we have here. So, this is the main cartridge, I believe. Uh, like I said, I'm not a suspension guy, so not sure. Um, do one of these for you there so you can see the top. So, oh, you get back over here, bike. You gotta be straight for logos. Okay, so anyway, uh, you get the new caps that are gonna go on your bike. Um, you have your preload adjustment on the outside here. You have your compression on the top, and then this will thread into the bottom of your fork lug here. This is gonna be your rebound, so you'll have compression on both tops, rebound on the bottom. Um, not sure the names of all these parts here. You got a rod, I believe, that kind of goes in through here. This pushes, oh, 
didn't drop it, we're still good. Um, so you can get everything set up the way you want. Like I said, I'm not a suspension guy. I just wanna show you what comes in the box here and uh, give you a quick breakdown before we do a full review video. Um, I'll be better at that part because I can actually ride a dirt bike decent. Um, but just wanna show you what comes in the box here because there's not much online about this. It's still very new and it's pretty damn exciting. So we're gonna take the stuff off. I'm gonna pull the forks off, pull my shock off for some other stuff, do a bladder kit conversion on that, and take it up to Schmidt Performance up in Paris, California, and get them rocking on this bike. And uh, while that's going on, we can start the build on the bike as well, because I got all sorts of great parts for it. So yeah, um, thanks for checking this out with me. If you guys wanna order it, I'll put the parts in the description. You can pick it up from uh, bikebandit.com. You can pick it up from AEO Power Sports or wherever you buy your KTM stuff. Once again, guys, I'm Travis with Every Single Sunday. Thanks so much for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel, and we got all sorts of cool stuff going on here for you. Get out and ride.